What's up guys, today I'm going to be doing a quick start guide to Final Cut Pro, going from the first time you open Final Cut Pro all the way to exporting a project. So the first thing you want to do is create a new library. If we go up here to file and go to new and then library, let's call this quick start guide. So these libraries will be saved in your movies folder and they'll contain all of the editing and projects that you do. So let's go ahead and save that. So the library will show up here on the top left. And then this is an event. You can create more events uh, just to organize your footage better. Your project and your video clips will be saved within these events. I'm going to go ahead and right click on this event and create a new project. And we'll just call this test project. And this is where you pick the settings for your project. It's not too vital that you get all of this perfect. You can change them afterwards. But let's just go for a standard. A 1080p project you can select the event that you want to save the project in and then let's click OK so now we have this this is the project up here and now we need some video clips to edit so I'm going to select my event go to file and then go to import media up here on the left is basically your hard drives and your computer I'm going to import footage from my hard drive so let's just pick some random footage right here. You can select multiple video clips or you can just select one at a time. So I'm going to select a video clip. Just make sure that it's going into the right event that you want it to. Click import selected. And then your video clip will be shown in your event up here. I actually just like to drag and drop my video clips from my finder into this um, box right here. It works exactly the same. So anyway, once your video clips are here, click and hold to select a portion of the video clip that you want to add to the timeline and then if you go down here you have these icons these are just different ways to add the video to the timeline so let's just use this one for now which drops the video clip on top of the magnetic timeline and then let's also add in this one so to export this timeline what you want to do is go up here to the export uh, tab on the top right hand side and I usually just go to Apple devices 1080p. The, the automatic settings are actually the ones that I normally use anyway. So we just go ahead, leave that as it is. Click next. This is where your video clip is going to be saved. So we just save it to the desktop. Click save. And now Final Cut Pro will export the whole timeline right to the end right here. So you can check on the exporting progress by clicking this button right here. This will show how long it's going to take for the video to render. And then when it's done, you can either go to the place in the finder where you saved it, or you'll get a notification on the top right saying that the share was successful. And then we can just click show and let's play this video. And that is the finished project that I just exported. And that is the last step in this quick start guide. I hope you find this useful if you're just using Final Cut Pro for the first time. Check out my other videos for more advanced tutorials. If you're looking for any extra video effects or plugins for Final Cut Pro, then check out my website. The link is in the description. And yeah, subscribe for more videos. I'm going to try and stick to weekly videos every Monday. I hope you guys enjoyed this one and I'll see you in the next video.